for the Chicago Sun-Times, I'm Lori Rackle, and this is Lori's List, where I talk about some of the notable shows coming up on TV this week. Tonight, we go back to a tumultuous time with PBS's The Trials of Muhammad Ali. In this 90-minute look at one of the most controversial sports figures of our time, Chicago filmmaker Bill Siegel explores Ali's toughest fight, the champion boxer's battle to overturn a prison sentence for refusing to serve in the U.S. military. The documentary includes interviews with Ali's ex-wife, Chicago native Khalila Camacho Ali, and Nation of Islam leader Louis Farrakhan. It's rounded out with riveting archival footage of Ali's fiery exchanges during TV appearances that would have been viral sensations had they happened today. I'm just today. ready to fight, and I'm glad it'll be here where all these big mouth people here in Miami talking about I talk too much, and this one's gonna whoop me. Well, I want all of them to be there, and I'm gonna shut up all of his mouth. The Coen Brothers Oscar-winning film Fargo lives on in FX's 10-episode limited series that retains much of the movie's quirky tone and Minnesota nice, even though it's built around a different true crime story and features a new crop of eccentric characters. How you been, Lester? Oh yeah, real good. Yeah? Yeah. Newcomer Allison Tolman, a Chicago comedian, more than holds her own against an impressive cast that includes Billy Bob Thornton as a sufficiently creepy, cold-blooded criminal, Martin Freeman as an easily manipulated sad sack insurance salesman, and Colin Hanks as Ernest Duluth police deputy and single dad. I wish they'd make better use of Naperville native Bob Odenkirk, who's capable of much more than we see in early episodes. The show's pace is slow in spots, but the dark humor and twisted tone make it oddly compelling. If you haven't seen BBC America's Orphan Black, you're missing out. This wildly fun, sexy sci-fi thriller about a cloning experiment gone awry boasts one of television's best performances, Make That Multiple Performances, by Tatiana Maslany. The Canadian actress plays clones who look alike but have very little in common, except that they're all in danger from mysterious factions that want to either control or kill them. This cult hit deserves mainstream success in its second season, which wastes no time diving back into the heart-pounding action. Witch-infested 17th century Massachusetts is the setting for Salem, a disturbing drama that puts shock value ahead of storytelling. It's basically a poor man's American horror story coven, but with more shrieking and less fun. On the upside, Janet Montgomery makes for an intriguing sorceress. And if you're a fan of supernatural horror, you could do worse than this period piece, cable channel WGN America's first foray into original series programming. 